2013, Fox and Frolics and Worcestershire County Council have gotten together to create a course where you can come with your carer or mum or dad, grandma, granddad and learn how to sew some simple items really quickly and really expertly. A couple of weeks ago we created this amazing one seam skirt. We used some cotton fabric but you can use any fabric you like really. On the sample that I made at home, so you can see my floor here, I have been using jersey. And you need 1 meter 70 in length, so you just cut that off. And you also cut your waistband. Now the waistband needs to be quite wide, twice the width you want it, plus seam allowance. And we're going to iron some violin on it, just to make it a little bit stiffer and easier to work with. And you're already putting on your pleats and the top of the skirt. If you wanted to gather it, that also looks really cute, like you can see on the right hand side here. The girl is putting in some gather threads, which are two threads, stitch length five or six, all the way along, and then you just pull the top threads, and voila, you can put your waistband on already. And it's great fun for everyone. And this is the uh, important thing to remember, you leave two centimeters open at the beginning and the end, but also, you come from the inside, so you make sure that your waistband is placed on the wrong side of the fabric first. It will roll out to the outside, that's much easier. Now you can close your side seam and you can clearly see why we needed to leave open a gap, because otherwise we couldn't have done that. Because the waistband faces the different direction, so you again close that and the lower end is already turned in. I've ironed that over but you could just turn it in. And I've closed my side seam, closed the waistband seam as well. And now I can sew those remaining four or five centimeters across to attach the waistband. Now we're going to turn up our hem really easy. Turn in one centimeter and then maybe up to 0.5 or 3, whatever you feel comfortable with. Stitch it into place and the skirt's almost finished. Now we want to roll over the waistband to the outside. That's so much easier than working the other way around because it's always important that that stitch that you see is the one that's stitched from the outside. You can go very slow, as you can see here, or you can go faster. And finally, we're going to choose a button. I've got a button wool foot on with my fab machine here, and I folded over the fabric exactly where you've also got your seam, so that that's nicely covered of the waistband, and also the seam of the skirt is in that area. that's done, all that remains to be done is to cut open your buttonhole, put your needle through, check out of course that it's the right sort of tightness around the waist, put the skirt on, see where it needs to go, then sew it into place and finally cut off the threads and close your button. And there you've got a beautiful skirt and it'll take you less than 40 minutes to make. If you want to create something special in two and a half hours for four weeks, four different projects from January 2013 in libraries across Worcestershire, then get in touch.